Hey guys, welcome to another video. It's your girl Tashana and today I'll be decorating my Christmas tree. So guys, to be honest, I love Christmas and all, but I'm not very big on decorating for Christmas. Reason being, I think it's a lot of work. But ever since I have my daughter, I try to at least put up a tree each year. And now that she's getting older and she's understanding more what Christmas is, I've decided that I have to step up on the decorating. So I'll be doing a little bit more than the tree this year. However, in this video, I'm just going to be decorating my tree. All right. So. Usually when I'm decorating my tree, I go for a monochromatic look. Uh, two tones could work too. I think I'll be doing two tones for this year. So I think that decorating the tree with one or two colors is enough, maybe three. Um, I mean, that's the way I see it. I mean, I've seen other people they use a lot of different colors and the tree turns out nice however for me i prefer to use one or two colors maximum three so today for this tree i'm going for uh blue and silver blue is my favorite color yes and it goes with the decor of my living room so yeah so let's get started all right guys so i just finished lighting the tree and i just put my first two rows of ornaments on the tree i don't know if you can see it i'll bring the camera closer eventually but um, i don't just randomly place the ornaments on the tree i'm not sure how other people do it but for me um my ornaments need to be equally spaced and there must be like a pattern so they all need to be i guess go aligned like going you know in the same direction type of thing so yeah I'll bring the camera closer for you to see that right so guys um this is what i'm talking about um you know i try to equally spaced my ornaments and uh, i'm gonna try to do that all the way to the bottom now i didn't go all the way around yet i'll get there but um let's continue okay guys so i'm gonna continue putting the ornaments and this is gonna take me a while because of the way that i'm doing it and i know know it's tedious but it is just my way so I'm gonna wanna put the next set of ornaments maybe around here so this one is like right under this one like that Okay. Also, I like to use the same like texture and size ornaments. Yes. So the next one will go here like so. And the next one will go here like so.
Okay guys, so I finished placing the ornaments on the tree all the way to the bottom and they look equally spaced to me. I'll give you a close-up view after. And now I'm going to be putting these shiny um, ornaments in the inner part of the tree so that there could be like a nice reflection. Alright, so let's get started with that. So now I'm going to start putting these and I think I'm going to be placing them diagonally on the tree. So let's see how that works and let's hope I have enough. Okay guys, so there you have it. I put the flower ornaments diagonally as best as I could, but I need more. I definitely need more. Okay, so now I'm just going to put the star and the tree will be complete for now. enough hey guys so the star is on top of the tree now this star can light up but um the lighting is yellow and the lighting on the tree is white so i don't like to mix colors like that so i'll just keep it like that for now chances are i will change it um and definitely I hope to get more of these flower ornaments so I can add more to the tree so it could look more full. And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching that video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to subscribe, like, comment, share, and hit the notification bell. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.